Alright, I am in Syed Valley, and I uh, just had lunch at the cafe, it was excellent. This is a great little town, their food was really, really good, and their milkshakes I think are the best on the trail. Um, the RV park lets hikers just bum around here, so over here we've got landslide and handbrake. There's Plug, and everybody's just napping. Say hi, Plug. There we go. <laughs> I don't know where Miss Frizzle went. There's a few other people bumming around, taking showers and doing laundry. Go have a milkshake. Go have a milkshake. You're gonna be amazed. Delicious. I had the Oreo cupcake. It was really good. All right, I want to show you what I put in my resupply box here. Um, can you see all that food? That's a lot of food. That food is supposed to take me to Ashland. It's my next stop. Thing is, Ashland is only two and a half days away. This is this is too much food. I don't know why, but I planned for almost five days worth of food to get me to Ashland. I don't know what I was thinking. Um, but. Here's what we got. Pringles. Excellent. Uh, I'm also going to walk you through what I'm totally sick of and would not pack again. Um, this fruit, mixed fruit, I loved in the beginning. Um, same with uh, candied pineapples. Um, I can't do the candied dry fruit anymore. They're way too sweet. I'm just like on sugar overload. So any any dried fruit that's also been candied, out. I just give it away. I can't I can't eat it. Um, but dried fruit that's not candied, like Trader Joe's apricots or fruit leather. Oh man, that that's awesome. Um, cookies, amazing. These are Trader Joe's schoolhouse school book cinnamon cookies. There's Miss Grizzle. Yay! Wait, where is she? Where is she? This is all, there she is. <laughs> um, these are great. I really do love the frosty, sugary, partially hydrogenated, high fructose corn syrup deliciousness cookies, but these are really great, and I have not gotten sick of these. Um, okay, dinners. Lipton soup, doctored up with uh, home dehydrated veggies, chicken. It's pretty good. Um, this is my favorite thing to eat on the trail. Curry couscous. Came from a box and then I added vegetables, dehydrated myself. And um, so there's some freeze dried beef in there. I got dehydrated Trader Joe's lentil soup. I've added some dehydrated potatoes. And then this is a mountain house um, dehydrated spaghetti, freeze dried spaghetti, which I put into a Ziploc baggie. We got homemade veggie burrito, yummy. Homemade pumpkin pie, yummy. That these make great breakfasts actually, um, because there's lots of nuts and pumpkin and maple syrup in one of those. That's really yummy. Corn nuts, totally sick of them. Gonna give them away. Peanut M Ms, awesome. Uh, Fig bars. I wouldn't exactly call myself sick of them. I'm still eating one package of these a day, sometimes two. It's pretty good. 220 calories for two fig bars. So, that's alright. I got lots of these kind of bars. The Z bars are good. I don't like a regular Cliff bar, but I like the kid version. They're usually softer and taste better. Got some yummy. Kashi Berry Lemonade Bar, Luna, Lemon Zest is my favorite flavor, uh, some other bars too, um, oh I got a whole jar of peanut butter, peanut butter is awesome, um, but I'm totally sick of it, sick of peanut butter, I completely overestimated how much peanut butter I was going to be eating on this trail, so I'm going to have to get rid of that. Body glide. Luckily, I don't need it. 
turkey jerky, which is great. I also really like beef jerky. I actually really like my dad's homemade jerky, but I ate it all. He sent me six bags of home dehydrated organic beef jerky. He sent all six bags to Belden at the same time, so I had to carry all six bags or eat it. So I ate it. I ate all of it. Now I'm not really that interested in anybody else's jerky. Um, roasted seaweed, also Trader Joe's. This is awesome. It's a really fun, like, snacky thing at night or during siesta time. Only thing is that they're really bulky, so don't pack these when you have to carry a lot of food because they take up too much room for what they give you. Um, I've never gotten sick of these. I wish I had a lot of these. I also wish I had a lot of these. Starbucks Vias. Wish I had way more of these. Um, True Lemon. Love it. True Lime. Awesome. Even put it on the burrito. True Grapefruit. Love it. I just overestimated how much I was going to need. Tea. Not drinking very much tea, unfortunately. I kind of just want coffee these days. <laughs> hey. I'm doing my video. <laughs> my, my massive box here. <laughs> Emergency. Um, not everybody likes these. I like them. I think they're great. No, so I usually have one Maybe one a day, maybe one every other day or something. And, um, oh, these, okay, when I did like peanut butter, these were amazing. Um, strawberry preserves, single serving packet. I put peanut butter and preserves on my tortilla, and it was great, but now I'm really sick of peanut butter, so I'm not eating PB&J anymore. Um, it's a shame, because these things are pretty great. I thought about just like squeezing it into my mouth, but I don't think it would be as good. Uh, what else? Oh, I put, I got Neato Milk. Gotta get the whole, don't get the skim. I got a little bag of Kleenex in here. I've got some dental floss. And get this kind with the stick because you don't want to, you know, like put your fingers in your mouth when you're flossing because your fingers are filthy. And these. Wizzy wipes in the corner there. They're great. Basically, they're wet wipes that you add water to and then they expand, which is good. Um, and q tips. These are awesome. Anyways, that's what's in my resupply box, and that's what I'm sick of, and that's what I love. Yeah. And so I'm going to go dump everything I don't want into the hiker box. Maybe take a few things out that I do want, although I shouldn't take anything out because I'm trying to get rid of food. Two and a half days to Ashland. I don't need this much food. Alright, Syed Valley, me and Miss Frizz, saying goodbye.